Hey everyone, welcome to day number six of Rocky Mountain Race Week. We have made it to Julesburg. Uh, Julesburg is the oldest running drag strip in the United States, so pretty, uh, pretty cool track here. It's an old one. It's actually a old airport. You can see the hangars behind me here and here. Uh, and then the tracks out here are just kind of out in the grass. It's just like an airport. Is uh, no concrete walls or anything. It doesn't look like. Uh, it looks like they got some K-Rail, I guess. Uh, I've actually never been to this track, even though it is here in Colorado. It's way up in the corner here. Um, but day number six, we're going to uh, make some hits. Try to get on the road early because it's probably at least going to be a five-hour drive back to Pueblo, our, hotel, our hometown. Uh, and we don't want to really be driving at night if we don't have to be. The flight's doing well. Uh, yesterday was a good day, 1250. Today, we're up about a thousand more feet in elevation, so we'll see how he does here. Here we go, gonna run my first So April's gonna have to lift early to try to go 13-0. That's what we're gonna try to do here. Really easy, stop. Okay, you're in deep, so just wait. Go. Slip came in at. She lifted. She lifted where I told her. I, I don't know if that's enough to go out quick. So that'll that'll give us a judgment zone. Then on the next time, if she has to make another hit, she'll know to run it a little bit past that and then lift there to try to go the 13. No, either way, that should be a usable slip. But she might want a better time if it's like a high 13 or whatever. She can't. She can't lose from that. So I have to make another one. See, see what it came in at, give us an idea. So Clyde went 1279 here uh, all the way out. April lifted a bit early, went 13.4, so the next pass I'll have to lift early. And we're just trying to judge the track and where we gotta lift at. So she'll probably make another pass to try to better 13.4. So if not, that leaves the door open for me to beat her. So I'm sure she'll uh, try to better that there. gonna get my second pass the first one I want a 1279 so I broke out I need a 13-0 uh, or slower pass see something better than a 13-4 to get ahead of uh, April here so <laughs> we got 2,000 separating us right now before today
Thank you. 130 mile drive. There's still a lot of cars still making passes. Some people didn't have the best luck on the first hit. Uh, we ended up getting both our hits in. We got slips turned in and everything else. So we are going to go ahead and hit the road, get some gas, food, and we got about 330 miles. We figure it's about a five hour drive. Uh, yep, on the road again. And uh, we'll have Pueblo tomorrow to finish out this event. And hopefully all goes well. We just need Clyde to give us another 330 miles of reliability. and. We'll be all right. Get to sleep at home tonight. <laughs> all right, guys. We'll uh, check in with you guys as we get on the road. About four hours in. The gears in the back are... Yeah. Terrible. They're getting pretty bad. I don't, it just, I don't know if it's the end of the trip or the way the wind's blowing or what, but we definitely hear them. Pretty, I'd say the worst is the, this whole trip. April's blocking out some April's blocking out some sun. But uh, just cruising along. Trying to make some decent time out and through the middle of nowhere. That's pretty much what it's been for uh, the last six days. Five days, six, six days. So cars doing good though. race week completed here this is the final part of it we'll head home tonight and be back tomorrow for the final race day but we've made it Clyde brand new fresh build made it 13 ish hundred miles we only had a couple little hiccups along the way through rain through heat through everything So proud of that dang car. So proud of April for going on the journey with me and learning to race and having a blast doing it. So, but we are here. We just barely beat sundown. So we're gonna go home, get some rest, and get ready for tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for the support and watching all these videos. We will see you guys next time. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And I appreciate it. See you next time.